Next question is from Hacko Boo. What are some ways to deal with protein farts? You know what's funny is that <laughs> yeah. there's a name for it because it's so common. Is there a way to deal with this? Yes, and because okay. it's so the reason why what people story think, comes to mind right away when you when you hear protein. Oh farts. God, <laughs> we already sold this. That time one. we were hanging around with <laughs> with, with, with the WWE because it was the most it was the worst I've ever in my life experienced, Bro, and I've been uh, around protein farts. It, we were held hostage with that. It one. It literally those. was a gremlin that came out and then it it grabbed you on your back and wouldn't leave. You couldn't leave. There's nowhere you could go. It was on you. So here's uh, the deal. It's so common that farts. people think that this is a normal reaction from taking protein or eating protein. Like, oh, yeah. protein farts. Yeah, that's what happens when you have a lot of protein. No, that's what happens when your digestion is off. You should not... Now, farts are not supposed to be putrid. It's true. That is a sign that your digestion is a little off. Now, it doesn't mean your farts should smell amazing, but it doesn't mean that you yeah. fart and then your partner's like, I got to leave the room myth. or you're embarrassed because... You pass gas and everybody is just like running out uh, of the room. If you have this issue, it's a digestive issue. So what I would say is examine your food or your protein powder. Do you know how many people take whey protein, get protein farts and think it's normal, not realizing they probably have an intolerance to whey and they probably should switch to something that's easier digested? Yeah. Some advice, look at the food that you're eating. <clears throat> And maybe you're not digesting it well. That might be the issue, and you could try where, an elimination. Where diet. at what point does uh, like at what point does farting become uh, no longer like a natural? Like you would you would you would say that oh the, the the process of your body farting once or twice a day is pretty natural. Well, it's more than that. I think we're, the average person I don't know how many times they fart. Yeah, that's right. I'm, where I'm getting where I'm going 25. though with this is like at what point is it not natural anymore? And it's your body trying to tell you you're probably consuming too much of something. I think you're if not it becomes to. painful, you have painful gas, like oh my god, I have to fart. Um, and then the really bad smelling ones is telling you that there's something off with your gut or the foods that you're eating that you're not yeah. digesting well. Because, well, I mean, you can still get that from something like broccoli. I mean, like, I know for <laughs> some clients and myself. Sulfur, even, right? Yeah, it's just, uh, I don't know if it's that because there's, like, some of the methane production of that. Isn't it high sulfur diets will do sulfur, that, too? They can. Sure, but... However, try this. I used to get clients that would say they that, used too, to with tear broccoli. Me up. They, they used to say the same thing, and I'd say, try cooking your broccoli really well. Yeah, it's probably see that. see if that happens again, mm -hmm. and it doesn't. Yeah, it's because broccoli can, for some people, be hard to digest, especially if it's raw or barely steamed. Just cook it more and then see what happens. Yeah, change your diet up. I used to think this was normal. Oh, I'm eating a high protein diet. That's why I'm having these terrible, you know, farts or whatever. Yeah. No, it's not the case. Digestive enzymes can can help. So we work with a company called Masszymes that makes digestive enzymes that can help. <laughs> but you, mainly, it's you're probably consuming. Something in your diet that's not working with your digestion, or you're not getting enough of fiber, or maybe you're eating too much fiber. That can also be a problem. It was too much dairy for me when it was. Really? I can I can tolerate a certain amount of dairy in my diet, but when I when I was like lots of dairy, that's when I experienced that. And if like if I had let's say the same amount of protein a day, let's say the the protein target was 200 grams. And I went on a on a on a kick where I was consistently eating 200 grams, all from meat and whole foods. No problems. Mm -hmm. If I, in order to hit 200 grams, I was having one or two protein bars yeah. and a whey shake in there and maybe milk mm -hmm. or ice cream or something else or cheese in the diet, that would, that would fuck me up. I mean, also, it, I mean, do we consider as well that it's liquid and you're drinking it and you're also ingesting more air as it's going down and you're also consuming more oh, calories than normal. Yeah, but but that That's would be, an interesting that theory. would make you fart more, but that ne doesn't necessarily right. make your farts smell right, terrible in terms of the smell of it. But and do yeah. you really I think, think your own farts smell terrible? I don't think you do. That your own fart? I can tell when mine. You like smell your own up. farts? I what mean, he does? Everybody he, likes. He traps us. That's that's is that true? You know, do you always smell your fart? If it's if it's smelly, I do. You smell it no matter what. What? <laughs> <laughs> Don't lie to the audience right no, now. Dude. Everybody likes to smell dude, their own farts. That's, that's my a, brand. That's first of all, that's a saying. I don't think it's literal. That's true. It's not true. <laughs> that's true. I have never smelled my fart and thought to myself like, mm, that's a." It's definitely nice. you don't like, stop worse you, when it's somebody else. You're else's. forty something years old and you you have smelt a lot of your own farts. If right. you were to fart right now, you would smell it. If it's smelly, I would, but it doesn't mean no, I no, like no. it. What do you mean? If it's you, the only way you know it's smelly is because you okay, smell it right. every time. So if I smell it, I'm not sitting here thinking that's great. I'm thinking <laughs> I can't get away from it. It's attached to me. Do you, do you take? Do you believe this? I don't believe this. I think he. Loves I believe he does this. That is the is worst. <laughs> that is so not true. Yes. That is the this most disgusting. See so you thing. flexing in the mirror. Yes. Oh wow! Look at that. Yeah. 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 And mix it in with flexing. <laughs> what kind of a weirdo? <laughs> you imagine uh, you walk gonna, in that's on your buddy. Be a new trend. You're just like. 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's me. That's you know what? I, I bet you that exists somewhere. There's I'm probably sure a weird a fetish. genre for yeah. that. Remember that video, Cake Farts? Anyway, don't look it up. Yeah. That was a thing on the internet for a second. Hey, if you enjoyed that clip, you can find the full episode here, or you can find other clips over here. And be sure to subscribe.